Good morning, Washington. This is Big Dave here on Dave TV for the 4th of July, 2012. <laughs> 4th of July, 2012. How y'all doing, everybody? Da, da, da. Let's crank up some light. Actually, it's kind of cloudy out there this morning, huh? Glad they did. I don't know. You know, um, last night, the 3rd, we had a nice little line of Thunder Boomers run through here, roll through here about, um, at about, um, Nine o'clock, so I'm glad last night wasn't the 4th of July, or they might have had some washouts in the fireworks. Well, 4th of July, 4th, the 4th, let's, uh, let's take a little listen here to some cool, some cool, um, little September audio. September 1814, British troops had burned Washington. Now they marched on Baltimore. Their fleet blocked the harbor. Only a tiny star-shaped fort stood in their way. Baltimore prepared for battle. The advancing British army was turned back. And though their ships bombarded the coast for a day and a night, Fort McHenry stood firm. By the dawn's early light, Francis Scott Key, seeing the American flag still waving, penned the Star's Spangled Banner. Today, Baltimore's triumph lives on. There's no better time to visit than now during the War of 1812 Bicentennial. For information about the new National Anthem Tour by Land and Sea or the Star-Spangled Baltimore Pass, call 1-877-BALTIMORE or visit starspangledbaltimore.com. Yeah, isn't that cool? <clears throat> That's the great Dude Walker. Oh, I'm out of focus the great dude walker there doing that uh, spot. I heard that on the radio the other day. It's running on all the local stations. And I said, oh, my God, that's dude walker. He has a very distinctive voice. Of course, he's you know, a long time, um, a long time um, local radio voice. Remember, he used to be on the Don, he used to do the Don and Mike show a lot. He used to hear the, his voice on there. Great. The great dude walker and a, and a fine advertiser here on DCRGV. Check out. He's got a, um, well, well, let's go. Why not do that? Let's just do, uh, let's just, I'll show you some cool stuff. Let's see here. Do, 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 do. So if you go to DCRTV.com, uh, and there is, there's a spot there, Dude Walker. You can go and click on this thing and, and the link there, and you can go click on his, his voiceover demos, Corvette at Le Mans, the Mob Doctor, Peyton Manning, Timeline, Star Wars, voiceover, uh, pure Michigan. He does a whole lot of stuff. Really cool guy and a really nice guy too. You know, some of these radio guys, some of these voiceover guys, you know, they they you know they're kind of like, hey, I am God's gift to the voice community. Dude is a really cool guy. He's really nice guy. He's he's humble and he's a, he's a, you know a, a, you tell him he's a local veteran and uh, here you, so you click on you can click on some of his links here. Like Corvette at Le Mans. And you can go to dudewalker.com. It's a cool website. I love that background. You're really, really cool site there. Look at that. Voiceovers and more. Call 1 877 Get Dude. You know, I have to ask him a question someday. And I, I don't think I, I pretty probably answered this on uh, on Don and Mike once, but uh, well, how, how do you get the term name Dude? I, I don't think that's his real name. Hey, Dude. <laughs> I remember uh, seeing pictures of him there at the uh, Michael Mara. Remember Michael Mara's big uh, show there at the uh, State Theater at in Falls Church a couple months ago, and, and dude was all decked out there in his uh, in his uh, tuxedo. Uh, congrats to dude there on that cool um, Star Spangled Banner War of eighteen twelve Baltimore sounder thingy. So if you want to listen to that again, just. Uh, Go back to the start of this Dave TV and play it again. Southcom. Southcom is the uh, the uh, new owner of um, the Washington City Papers, if anybody cares. Uh, Washington City Paper, uh, Creative Loafing, the company that owns it, was put up for bankruptcy uh, reorganization a couple years ago. And, and Creative Loafing got bought by, by the publisher of the Chicago Sun-Times, or at least the Chicago Reader did. That's one of their papers. And then they have a paper in Atlanta and a paper here in Washington, City Paper. And those just got bought by the uh, company called Southcom. So whatever. Whatever. So what? Who cares? <laughs> I'm looking at the radio ratings that came out this week. Um, we just got the third week of June radio ratings, and I'm looking at WNEW. 
and uh, Baltimore, okay, they placed 39th. 39th in Baltimore. Now, WNEW actually has a better signal into the Baltimore market than it does into the entire D.C. market. And for them to be playing, play, being 39th place, wow. Mm, 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 mm. They're even below WRNR. <laughs> Who can be below WRNR FM? Aye. Uh, WNEW does a little bit better in the Washington market, but, uh, you know, not a hell of a lot. But, you know, I'm looking at the 2554s, which are what people call the money demos. You know, the latest numbers came out, and, uh, and uh, oh, what am I doing there? Okay. Hot 99.5 is first place in the money demo 2554. And, uh, you know, they're just holding steady. TOP is second place in a tie with WHUR for, for second place. Now, I'm looking at the money demo here, and, you know, in that money demo 2554, it's not even close. IHT, WIHT, Hot 99.5 is a 9.5 share. A 9.5 share in the full day ratings, and TOP and uh, HUR each of a 5.9, so it, Hot 95 is really pushing it there. <laughs> ay, 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 ay. But uh, we got HUR, we got WASH, we got WAMU, we got DC 101, we got uh, MMJ all in the top 10, uh, P PGC and uh, MZQ and BIG all in the top 10 there for the Money Demo 2554 for the third week of June. So they're all doing well. Uh, RQX is kind of eh, 11th place, and we're looking down the line. Fresh is down to 13th place. El Zol 16th, JFK 17th, MAL 18th. MAL 18th place. You know, this station, as I say, needs some fixing. Um, the Morning Show 18th place, Rush 19th place, Hannity 19th place. Nothing to brag about there. TEM 19 also tied for TEM is tied for 19th place, place with Wink FM at a Winchester. Why did I suddenly develop a list? I don't know. Where's NEW? NEW 27th place. 27th place in the mornings. 33rd place in middays. 29th place in afternoon drive. I don't know. Maybe the Washingtonians just talked out. You know, maybe they're just tired of talk radio, WMAL and the news and all. I don't know. You know, they, think, they figure, okay, we got AMU, which is good. We got uh, TOP, which is good. We don't need anything else. Everyone just play music. <laughs> uh, anyhow, so there. All right, folks, uh, that's going to be it. I'm going to keep it as a relatively short Dave TV for today. Happy 4th of July. Hope, uh, I hope a der another derecho show doesn't come through tonight and wreck your 4th of July plans. Wouldn't it be cool, though, if they're shooting off the fireworks and a derecho show comes through and there's, like, 90-mile-an-hour winds and the fireworks are blowing all over the place? And That might be kind of neat. <laughs> All right, thanks for watching, Dave. Happy 4th of July, everybody. So then.